In this video, we will take a quick look at the key features and tools of JSN Page Builder 3. Let's start by creating a new article to experience JSN Page Builder 3. Enter the article title. This article is already managed by JSN Page Builder 3, so we don't need to switch editors. Save and click on the Click to Edit button to start. This is the JSN Page Builder 3 interface. The first is the main bar, which allows you to set up some general information on your page, including article title and page settings with general settings for the article, such as status, intro image, and category. Meta SEO allows you to add a meta description and meta keywords. The template library window will pop up when you click on the Pick a Template button. You can filter a template by template industry, template type, and select the number of templates per row. JSN Page Builder supports more than 35 page templates. All these sample templates are selected carefully from our top favorite landing pages. After selecting your favorite page template, click on Start with this template button. Click on the Start from Blank button to build your page from zero. The next feature on the menu bar is device type with three options, laptop, tablet, and mobile. Click undo to go back, redo to go forth. Exit full screen allows you to exit JSN Page Builder 3 and go back to Joomla admin default. Import or export the current page in JSON file format. View, close, and save some options. Next is the left side, starting with the Add Basic Element feature. Here are some basic elements and sections that allow you to drag and drop them into the page editor. You can search elements or sections via the search box on the top. This is the Add Joomla Element feature. This contains Joomla elements. Next is the Add Save section. It allows you to store saved sections that you can reuse in another part of the page or on a different page. On the bottom is See Versions History, which shows auto-saved and published versions. The feature will be activated once you publish the page. Next is Show Page Outline, where it displays the page outline inside the editor. Here is Set Predefined Style feature, allowing you to create a generic style for boxes, buttons, and text. The last one is Add Custom Code feature. Click here and add your own CSS and JavaScript code to the page. Now let's try to drag a section to the page editor to explore other new features. This is the element toolbar that quickly performs actions on the element including move, duplicate, delete, pick a predefined style, save style, copy style, paste style. The element toolbar is shown on all the elements of the section. You can check them via breadcrumbs on the bottom. The last area is the Element Inspector on the right of the page editor. Here you can edit the settings and stylings of the element with three tabs, General, Styling, and Advanced. When you're working with images on the JSN Page Builder 3, you will see the media selector that helps you easily manage your media with just a few clicks. Once you're done building the article, don't forget to hit save.
and preview your article via Preview under View button. Thank you for watching. Please check our other videos to learn more about how to work with the JSN Page Builder 3.